what's up world how we doing today am i be i'm back with another video again if it's your first time here like share comment subscribe leave leave reviews let me know what to do today i'm gonna be reacting to why trouble got shot um i heard he was you know shot and killed he was with a, a girl and stuff like that but i didn't really hear the whole story so i'm gonna do a review to what actually happened and one if you don't know who trouble is the best way i can explain him is if you ever heard thief in the night by young thug there you go Let's get straight into it. And again, I'm watching Academics. Shout out Academics. Guy got all the videos. Let's just check it out now. Holy. Now it's always over a goddamn thought. If you guys haven't heard the news by now, Rapper Trouble was actually killed after he was trying to have a sneaky link, okay? Now, ladies and gentlemen, Rapper Trouble was visiting a woman, and apparently, when her ex boyfriend, a notorious simp, Name uh, Jamichael Jones, aka J Mike from the Fab Five. He's a failed rapper as well. Basically, bust in the door and he started shooting. Okay, now, ladies and gentlemen, you might know Trouble from, you know, he has a popular collab with Drake. You know, he was affiliated and signed to Ear Drummers as well. And, um. Can't trust these females. They be out of relationships for a week, two weeks, a month. And they already have you come over and, and you don't know the situation that's going on and then bam you caught in the middle of their their shit. Yeah, like he's a pretty popular rapper out of Atlanta. Somebody's car alarm is going off. I don't know if y'all heard. Okay. Now, this is the first rule he broke. I'm gonna keep it a hundred. And by the way, we're sending all condolences. This is definitely meant to show sympathy to those who are affected by his death. But we do have to learn some lessons because these hoes, they're not playing fair. Okay, number one. He broke the rule of playing away games. Okay, you can't play no away games with these chicks. You can't tell them the location. You got to give them a fake location and pick them up, then bring them to the real location. And hopefully that's a goddamn hotel where you're the only one that got the key and you got somebody that's downstairs. Okay. Y'all did y'all just see that? I was like, what the hell? What's going on right there? That's man? a goddamn hotel where you're the only one that got the key and you got somebody that's downstairs. Okay. On four. The funny thing is, I just threw that in there. He didn't have to do that. He didn't have to. Fortunately, these days, you can't trust these chicks more than you can fuck them, okay? That's just the reality of the situation, okay? So, Trouble, who was linking with a chick, probably didn't even know about the guy. Let's be very honest. We're going to have to use some common sense here, people, okay? Now, some people do get off at the fact they're fucking another nigga's girl. And by the way, anytime a girl tells you she had got a toxic boyfriend or a boyfriend who used to beat her ass or sometimes there might be some crazy domestic situation where like the, you know the dude is down to kill over her that's never her ex-boyfriend and this is what women do a lot they love to say they're crazy on and off guy is their ex that's not their ex that's their man they just keep being on and off we got a girl that's telling you any of these things the academics just said you don't even be involved with them there's too many girls in this world women i should say in this world F for you to have to pick one that's dealing with that right now like Oh, you don't put yourself in these situations. Off. And women will put another guy in danger by when in their off period, they claim they're messing with you, talking about they're moving on. They're not moving on, okay? Because first and foremost, you got to realize this woman probably knew this guy was liable to pop up at any moment. Trouble was probably in there just trying to have a good time. He probably know what was going on. This ain't his issue. Like, that's the issue between them. Of course, the simp probably pulled up, heard Trouble Donkey fucking her from outside in the parking lot. This loser grabbed a gun, start forcing yeah, his wild. big ass into the fucking crib. Probably, probably by the time he got in, Trouble was putting on his goddamn socks and boxes, and this fool shot Trouble in the chest. Okay? Now, again, this is the crazy part about it. Trouble lost his life. This simp is going to jail for life. So, basically, Trouble was at a girl's crib, and her ex came that she was recently had broken up with, and, yeah. He ended up getting shot because he was in the middle. He was there at the curb. And then eventually this chick is going to be fucking another nigga and then doing the same thing with another sneaky link. It's all a repeatable cycle, except the only people who lose are the men. Okay, the women ain't going to learn no goddamn lesson than this. For them, they're going to be like, oh, well, you know, it's kind of unfortunate, but they just move the hell on. Okay, criminal charges, I believe, should be lev levied on her too because clearly homie wasn't trying to hurt her. He was only trying to kill the other dude. I think, listen, if she gave the location, if she if she sent any message communicating with that dude that probably led to him showing up there, I don't care if it was an argument, I think she should be charged with something because this is an issue between her and him, and this sim came in guns a-blazing because he couldn't believe another man was popping.
piping his girl down viciously okay unfortunately the pussy has claimed another victim and unfortunately we got to do the story to try to give warning signs to men because as much as some people get off at the fact that fucking other niggas girls trust me some niggas they're down to die for that pussy okay okay just remember to go that's gonna be it for that video but i'm gonna just say this if you're a woman that got a crazy ex don't be involved with somebody that had no idea about your issues trying to start a whole new life like if you don't got troubles in your past. Because now somebody lost their life because you couldn't keep your legs closed. Hey, check out loud. I hope y'all checking out for the next video.